Okay, so here's what's going on. I fly with Delta. If you fly with Delta long enough, eventually you'll hit what they call silver medallion status. And if you fly a little more, you'll hit gold and platinum. If you live on a plane, you'll hit diamond. And the thing is, I'm so close to getting platinum, I just need like one more flight to hit it. So, I booked a flight to New York City. Alright, thank you, Robin. Thank you. Cabin crew, doors to Ivan, cross check, stand by for all call, please. Happy holidays to you, my right here. Man, I'm only here for 12 hours. It's almost 7 a.m., and my flight leaves at like 6 p.m. I think that leaves me with just enough time to get a New York City bagel, ride the subway, and hopefully take as many rad film shots as we can. Alright man, take care. Plain bagel toasted with cream cheese. Okay, that's it. That's it. Thank you so much, man. Alrighty, let's get loaded up. Some T Max 400, Leica M6. Alright, let's get a uh, Get this beautiful arch right here to start us off. Empire State Building through the arch here. Three, two. First one down. All right, I like the way this intersection looks with the Empire State Building going in the back. Here we go, three, two, one. <sighs> Gotta be a little faster on the draw next time. I'm liking the light spilling on that building right there, dude. That looks really cool. Three, two, one. I think that one's gonna be pretty good. Okay, look at all the fun New York doggies. Yeah, take a sip. Three, two, one. Caught him, dude, a good old boy sitting down. Dude, I know, this is the last shot I'm gonna get at the Empire State Building, basically from the same angle. Sneak a little of this foreground stuff in it. Three, two, one. That's it, I'm done taking photos of that one. Let's go hit Grand Central Station and try and focus on some people in there. Cause basically so far I've gotten dogs and buildings. Whoa. All right, it's not the Empire State Building though, but it's just framed up so nicely in that Chrysler building there. Three, two, one. All right, I think there's a statue of Harambe over here, dude. We gotta go get that. And what a gentleman, he's got a bow tie on. Three, two, one. Kind of a dumb shot, but a yellow gorilla, you gotta get a shot. To Grand Central Station, no more distractions. We just went for it. Are they come again, three, two? I think that's gonna be pretty good. Finally, the Grand Central Station. Made it. I think, dude, I think we should go up high, slow down the shutter speed, try and get the hustle and bustle and everyone kind of motion blur, just ever so slightly. Let's try a fourth. Three, two, one. Let's try one tall now. We're gonna go down to a half a second, dude. That's kind of gnarly. Three, two, one. <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. These escalators make for a nice subject. Gotta back up here, but these ladies won't get out of the way. Three, two, three. I don't know. I think that's gonna be pretty good. Honestly, dude, I think that's a shock. I'm gonna go back up 
take this escalator back down and to get some people coming up on the escalator. I think that's going to be pretty cool. All right, here we go, dude. Round three. Three, two, one. All right. Let's get the hell out of here. Times Square is just a few blocks this way. Okay, here we go. I don't know. We'll see if those work. I might be shaking too much. Here we go. <laughs> we went for it. We're going to sneak up behind these people, dude. We'll see if that one works. I came across this food cart that's got a bunch of bulbs all over it. I think that's going to look pretty good. Looking good, my man. Oh, he looked pissed, dude. Hopefully it's in focus. First roll of T-Max down, bro. Let's get the Radio City sign here. All right, dude, here we go. Three, two, one. Try to get a little bit of that lamppost in there. I think it'll be pretty good. Dude, we're gonna go for this cart. We're at an F8 at a 125th, dude. The stress, the pressure. Here we go, three, two. I'm just gonna get a shot of all these people who are here. Fucking pray. Three, two. Get your tickets now, dude. Man, this is a shot with all the umbrellas going. And the Empire State Building going in the background. Three, two, one. Pretty good. It's kind of fun, dude. There's a nice, we got the stop sign. Crosswalk, dude. Let's wait for someone. Oh, here goes someone. Three, two. Oh, there was a little bike in there, dude, but I think that's as good as we're gonna get. All right. It's just getting a little too wet, dude, to have this camera out there. So we're gonna try a little GoPro, either chest cam or like head cam. I think we're gonna go with the chest cam. All right, let's see what we can find, dude. There's some cool umbrella stuff going on. Three, two, one. Oh, kind of move him. Just this stuff to cross the road, these three umbrellas. Three, two, one. All the clocks in the background, I think that'll be fun. This dude's selling umbrellas here, that's kind of fun. Three, two, one. Oh, dude, let's get something through this glass right here. This is cool. Ooh, they're sharing a moment. Oh, if I got any balls at all, I'd get it, dude. I'm nervous, bro. That's any good. You know what? Let's see if we can find somebody sitting in a window, like a sandwich shop or something. That'd be fun. Yeah, she wasn't taking a bite, but I got it. It's actually still sick, though, dude. We're gonna get a shot of it. Let's see down the street a little bit. Oh, let's wait for this biker. That's dope, actually. Two, three, two. Got him. To be honest, dude, it's smaller than I thought. Rockefeller tree, here we go. Three, two, one. It's similar to one of the Grand Central Station, and we're just gonna kind of motion blur everybody here at a 15 a second. Three, two. Last one on the roll. Alrighty. I have some Cinestill 800T right here, and I don't have much time, dude. It's 2.36 right now, the flight's at six. Probably gonna leave around here around like four o'clock. Try and get to the airport by five. Let's load this up and then start shooting. Guy to poke his head out, look the other way. This guy's nice in there against the 
42 there. Dude, that was pretty good. Thanks, man. I gotta say, having platinum feels pretty good. Thank you. Just like that, 12 hours later, we're back. But you know what's got me feeling even better? Is knowing that I took this shot. I think by far it's the best from the trip. I know it might be a film photography trope at this point, but I really do feel like 800T is the best choice for shooting down in the subway. It just helps add to the grittiness of it and that's why it works so well. I also mixed up my cropping for some of these shots. Instead of my normal 4x3, I was using 16x9. Just because I felt like the 4x3 just wasn't working for some of them. Now, I don't know if this is against the rules or not, but I did some major cropping on some of the vertical shots, completely changing them to a landscape orientation. This cropping gives a little more focus to these photos. And if you disagree, well, I don't care. When I was filming, I was actually pretty bummed about the rain, just because I was stressed about my cameras. But looking back on it, it was a match made in analog heaven. Black and white film, New York City, and umbrellas. What more do you want? It was quite exciting doing some street photography, and it's something that I'm itching to try again. I just somehow have to make my way back out to New York, and hopefully the platinum status will help with that.